Hey guys, it's Yvette, and I have a box to open today that I haven't had in, in a bit, uh, and it's the Bloomery, it's the Bloom box from Bloomery Fabrics. It's been a bit. Um, I hadn't seen any of their Bloom boxes come up, um, and when I did see this one, I did go over to the Jelly Beanies and let you guys know that it was available, and with the Bloom box, you are able to choose which fabric you want to have in the box. And then they also throw in uh, a bit of notions and stuff like that. And it, they used to actually show you everything that was going to be in the box. But I think this time they didn't tell us everything. It was like they left a bit to, for a surprise, which I was really excited about. Because to me, that's the best part. I... Even if there's like, you know, 20 people open in the same box I have, I do not watch until, um, of course, I don't have time to watch anybody's videos. You guys know that. It's not, it's not purposeful. I'm not trying to like ignore everyone. I just don't have time. I don't have time to watch my videos. If I could somehow get them posted without ever having to watch them again, I would totally do it. <laughs> just to have more time for other stuff. Um, but anyway, this particular one, uh, it's obviously the Christmas box and I did go over to Jelly Beanies and let you guys know that it was available. I don't know how many people got it. Um, so if you got different fabric, perhaps you can come and show us on the Jelly Beanies what you got. And this particular time, I don't know what it is, but it took me a really long time to choose my fabric. And I, I don't know. I, I think I just had, a, I have a different idea in mind for... Christmas like when I'm thinking Christmas and even though there were plenty to choose from I mean I think they gave us like a good what like five or six or seven different fabrics to choose from and they just kind of curate a little bundle and you can uh, choose which one you like I wasn't really drawn a lot to any of them to be honest with you it's it's terrible I don't know and and normally it's like I have to try to pick between three, you know, because I can't decide. Um, and this time I felt like I had to just kind of go, well, which, you know, what, which one do I think I want? But, but anyway, I don't even remember which one I picked. So let's get this open. It comes in a mailer like this and the box is inside all pretty, pretty. So let's get it open. And the boxes are always so pretty. Again, I have no idea how they get these boxes to fit so perfectly in there because I always have such a hard time. Um, okay, so here's what it looks like now. And they do have like bloom box everywhere. And right here it says bloomerifabrics.com. And same thing over here. Okay, so let's get it open. Oh, I forgot. I didn't see this part. It says, you are so gifted. <laughs> okay, so here's what it looks like when you open it up. It's all wrapped up in a nice little tissue. And uh, we have a list inside that tells us everything that's in the box. that aside for a moment okay so first we have some wonder pins now I've been hearing about these I haven't used them yet I don't do um like a whole lot of quilting on my own I send my quilts out unless it's small enough that like if it's just a um like a mini quilt or something like that then I could go ahead and like do it myself and it's okay um so I want to try these I'm really excited that I got a pack and there are 20 in this box. And if you see, um, you can do the whole thing with one hand. So you have your pin open and um, you just kind of tuck it down and then push down. And it here, it kind of tries to show you here. And I've heard that there is a tiny bit of a learning curve. Um, and my friend Cherry Geyer 
told us of all about this. Um, she says that it does have a tiny bit of a learning curve, but once you get it, it's, it's super cool. Um, so I'm excited to have some. And let's see, we have a little ruler. And when I say it's a little ruler, I mean, it is a little ruler. It, this is what, one, two, three, four, six inches by one inch. <laughs> and obviously it's a motor ruler because it says that right there. And all you have to do is take this brown piece off and then it'll be, it'll be clear. So we have a little ruler. Ooh, now we have a, um, this is a zipper pull, P-U-L-L, P -U -L -L, by Emmeline Bags. And it says, handmade, and it is rose gold. And can you guys see that on there? I don't want to like, you know how it gets glary. It does say handmade. If you can't see that, just take my word for it. It really does say handmade. And Emmeline Bags, um, they, they designed some really great bags. So if you haven't heard of them, you should go check them out. Um, and they have lots of bag supplies if you've not done that. Oh my goodness. There's like a whole bunch of little things in here. Now we have a Moda, um, one of those little notebooks that you can keep in your purse. It's got a lot of like a little magnetic flap right here. And then see magnetic. And then when you pull this down, it's a little notepad and it's got all these little notes in there. Oh, is there more stuff in the? Oh no, it just made it look like that because of the way I turned it. Watch. Oh, come on now. It sort of made like it was a... Anyway, you know how they do those. Never mind. <laughs> okay, so a little notepad. And then we have a, an, the tiniest little full... <laughs> Let's take that back a minute. <laughs> the tiniest little wool pressing mat you've ever seen. <laughs> it's a four inch square, which that's tiny. <laughs> um, it's by the gist, the gypsy quilter. You guys, I can't even talk tonight. What in the world? Um, and so anyways, but we have a little wool pressing mat. Those are cool. And then now you guys, we have this little guy and that, that M is a Moda. So I'm not sure what Moda is giving us in a little velvet, black velvet bag, but let's see. <laughs> oh, they have it, they have it tied. The, the little string was also tied. I was like, why can't I get my finger in here? <laughs> okay. It fit, it like just fits in here. It's like very tight. Oh, it's like a needle minder and it says sewing mends the soul. Hold on. I'm taking it out of there. You won't be able to see. It's going to be glary. Come on out of there, buddy. Sewing mends the soul. I don't know where you're going to be able to see it best. That is so pretty. And see, it's a, it's a needle minder. So you have a magnet here and you put that magnet on the other side. So what I do with these is I put them up where <laughs> my, um, enamel pins are because I just put, you know, the magnet part on the back and it holds it on there. So I'm very excited to have this. I, I have never even seen these. That is gorgeous. Gosh, I really like that. Okay, um, and then we have the fabric. Let me just double check, make sure I got everything. It says, uh, the Snow Much Fun Fat Quarter Bundle, which I will show you, featuring prints from Dashwood Studio and Wyndham Fabrics. Wonder Pins by Clover. Sewing Men's the Soul Magnetic Pin and Needle Minder. A uh, four inch square wool pressing mat by the Gypsy Quilter. A one by six inch ruler. The metal zipper pull by Emmeline Bags. And a three inch by four inch sewing themed pocket notebook. 
Okay, so I have everything. That's everything in there. I think that's pretty good, guys. I, you know, let me show you the fabric and kind of scooch this out of the way a little bit. Okay, so here's the bundle that I chose. And they tied it with a little um, twine. <laughs> okay, so here's the first guy. And it has, um, I thought there was like somebody skiing. Oh, look, there he is. There's a little skiing guy. And there's another little skiing guy. And they have all these little houses in the woods. I did think this was cute. Don't get me wrong. It just didn't scream like Christmas per se. So I think these are the ones that they gave us to cho choose from were more like winter, which is fine. It's just... I, I don't know. I kind of guess I was kind of looking forward to like Christmas. Um, okay. But hey, no biggie. Seriously, no biggie. I ended up choosing and I like what I chose. What on earth? Why can't I get it to go back? Okay, there it is. Okay, here's the next one. And this one is um, all of the guys. I'm, I mean, I know this isn't what a ski lift looks like. I think I've never been on a ski lift in my life, but it looks to me like something that would be taking you back and forth across the mountain or up and down the mountain or something like that. And I just thought that was really cute. And they have little bunnies and bears um, inside the little cars and it's snowing. <laughs> okay. Uh, did I do? Oh, I did that one right. Yay. Okay. And now here we have uh, more little skiing guys and we have like a fox and um like i don't know is that like a a moose or something i don't know there's a rabbit there's a bear there's a whole bunch of friends skiing together <laughs> there they are okay and then we have these portraits of and it's a toss so it, you can turn it anyway and then you'll see somebody looking up like the little fox right here and then this bunny right here and then that bunny right there and then a christmas tree right there and a house right there i mean so it's 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 a toss you can put this anyway it's not directional um and just a whole bunch of little like portraits of stuff in there. And now we have the blenders. So here's the first one. And this just reminded me of having like a whole bunch of those snowballs, but they would be like in different colors. And then this guy, I don't know what this is. It's got like some little x's and then just little hash marks but it's super cute it almost looks like from far away it almost looks like it's a it's a dot or something but it's not it's got like some little details in there yep and so that was six fat quarters and all of these goodies and i don't remember how much i paid but i will let you know i'm sure that they're probably not selling these anymore but if they are i will include a link so that you can go and choose one for yourself and i will see you in the next video thanks so much for watching